creation stems are a great way to get students started with the creating process. And these plug and play idea stamp stems are very similar to ones that you probably already use in writing. It's just a sentence with fill in the blanks that you can use for any topic, skill, or content area. So here's a word bank. These are some suggestions of things that you might put into the sentences, but of course, you can make this work for your content area and your students. You might pick for students to do a specific video or have them design a graphic or some type of multimedia writing. And then here you could pick one of these things for them to work on. Many of these words are similar to what you might see in DOK three and four questions or in Bloom's higher taxonomy. So some of your sentence Sentences are, um, how does blank change? Why would blank be better than blank? So you could fill this in with, why would setting one be better than setting two? And depending on what you're studying, this could be even more specific. Why would the setting in the old house be better than a setting in the new house? So you have 10 places to start, and I tried to include various types of things for students to do, like analyze, compare, contrast. And these are things that all of your students can do, not just higher level students. In fact, words like analyze and compare and contrast will push students to produce even stronger work. So here are some examples. Compare and contrast Sam, it's the character, to Mary, a character. So again, number seven and then I plugged in maybe the character's names. You can make this anything. You could say compare and contrast World War I to World War II. Any topic would work here. How does the problem's organization change? So again, I filled in what I want students to look at using the first sentence stem. How does the problem's organization change? So this would be great for a math word problem or if you had students create their own problem. So again, these sentence stems can be used for any topic, skill, or content area. They just give you a place to start when working with your students, and they give students a place to start when thinking critically, collaboratively, and creatively.